If you have been using these old analog timers, it is time to pull the plug because we are getting smart. What is up guys? It is the Turtle Girl. Welcome to the channel or welcome back to the channel. Yeah, I said it. You don't need these analog timers anymore. But uh, let me back up just a little bit. So if you're watching, I'm almost certain, 100% certain, you have a fish tank, you have a turtle tank, you have reptiles, you have some kind of pet. And along with that, you're probably illuminating your tank somehow. You have basking lights, you have an aquarium light, you have a overhead light. And if you're any type of reasonable pet keeper, you know to use a timer for your lights. For one, it just simplifies everything. You don't have to worry about turning it on in the morning, turning it off at night. It's always super duper consistent for a photo period for your animal. Basically their day night cycle is always the same. It's like eight hours or 10 hours, whatever it might be. Controlling your light in your enclosures with a timer is really just an essential thing. So then why am I saying to ditch your analog timers? That is because there is a better alternative, or really not alternative, it's like the same thing, but it's smart. So this is the CASA Smart Wi-Fi timers, and the reason I am so excited about these, and I have, I don't know how I haven't heard of them yet, this, these have been around for like a long time, but basically this is a Wi-Fi timer, and there's an app, and you can control it from your phone. And why is this good? This is good because literally once you set this, you will be able to control it from your phone. If the power goes out, like with this, then you have to go back and make sure you reset the cycle because it stops the mechanics stop working if the power goes out. Whereas with this, it will actually retain the memory and you'll go straight back to your cycle because it syncs back up to your Wi-Fi, syncs back up to your phone. Plus, I mean, look at the size difference. You've got this big old thing and this. Something like this compared to this. Even more digital timers like this, you still have to set the current time, set a schedule, using some kind of button or pin system, and that is just a whole other hassle. So these smart timers are honestly for anyone who has a fish tank, a turtle tank, a reptile enclosure that has lights on it. I'm gonna go ahead and get this set up and then show you like how everything is set up in the app in just a second, but there is a link in the description if you want to purchase them. That is an affiliate link, so you're helping to support the channel if you buy through there. But really, get yourself a freaking smart timer because this, it makes so much sense nowadays with everyone having a phone in their pocket, everyone has Wi-Fi in their house, well, almost everyone. I mean, if you're watching this video, I don't know how you'd be watching it without Wi-Fi. I mean, maybe you'd be watching it on data, but then at that point, like you're probably watching it on your phone. So if you have the ability to watch this video, 95, maybe even 99% chance you have the capability to utilize a timer like this. And it just makes so much sense to be able to control your aquarium lights from your phone and not have to go back and check each individual one. Again, like I said, link in the description. But the other thing I want to mention too is that this literally costs the same amount or just about the same amount as the analog timer because you might pay, you know, five to eight dollars for a good analog timer. This, you can get the four pack for 21, I think it's on sale right now for 21 bucks. It might be 25 bucks, something like that. So it's kind of a no brainer. I think that everyone should switch out their analog timers to these, that's just my opinion. But let's get these set up and see how everything looks in the app. All right, so you can see here, I have my power outlet strip and I've already unplugged some of my things that need to be on timers. So first off, like I have a power strip here. That's what this thick one is. Usually it's most convenient to have your lights on like one power strip. So you only have to use one timer and that will control all your lights for a certain setup. We've got super duper simple instructions. You can see them right here. Uh, and so we're just gonna follow these and get the timer set up. Step number one is to download the app. So let's get it on our phone. Alrighty, so with the app downloaded, uh, I'm just going to go ahead and add a device. And then we have a smart plug. And we have, what is this? A smart plug mini. And then we're gonna plug this in. All right, so I had to connect to the Wi-Fi network of my 
casa or maybe i'm just realizing maybe it's casa like casa like house uh but anyway now it's going to establish a connection so now we want to link the smart plug to my wi-fi and i gotta input the password so you're gonna need to know your wi-fi password all right let's see if that connects all right, so now I get to actually name what this plug is for. So since this plug is going to be for this power outlet, which controls Hoku's tank, I am just going to input Hoku's tank. Okay, and now I can choose an icon, and they actually have a fish tank icon. You can see that? They even have a little fish tank, so I'm selecting the fish tank icon. All right, so now it is ready to use. So I'm gonna go ahead and plug in. They turned on and now I can set a schedule as far as what the power on and power off is. So I'm gonna set it 8 a.m. So I wanna put turn on power. All week I'm gonna have it at 8 a.m. Turn on and then turn off at 7 p.m. because right now it's winter so it's a little bit of a shorter photo period now the other really cool thing here too as far as scheduling is you have a sunrise and a sunset option so if you want just a really simple photo period that actually goes along with what's happening outside depending on what part of the world you're in the app actually takes your location and you can set it to turn on and off at sunset and sunrise within plus or minus one hour so you could do an hour before sunrise or maybe i would probably do an hour after sunrise um but anyway so that's really cool so that it'll automatically sense that and you'll be able to set it like that but i'm just gonna do a timer for simplicity's sake there we go and it automatically orders it according to obviously the time of day so that's the schedule for this tank i mean that's how simple it is and I can go back here and see there's all my tanks. So there you go. Once you have these set up, it's set and forget. And if you ever need to change anything, just go into the app, adjust it, and you are golden. You can control it all from one place. You don't have to be bending over and checking the pins on your analog timer when the power goes out. Again, there is a link right in the top line of the description if you want to get these. It is an affiliate link, so you're supporting the channel and that's at no extra cost to you. Um, and so I would really appreciate it if you went through that link, that would be great. If you have Prime, these timers will be on your doorstep in like two days, maybe, maybe three or four because you know. Amazon. But anyway, do it. You won't regret it. It's just one of those things that makes life easier. But anyway, I hope you found this little tip helpful. If you did enjoy it, feel free to drop the thumbs up down below. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you guys next time. Have a totally awesome day. Bye!